In this video, I'm going to explain the difference between two radiant barrier qualities which often get confused, reflectivity and emissivity. Basically, reflectivity is the ability to reflect radiant heat. Emissivity is the ability to not allow heat to be emitted in a radiant form. And I'm going to show you a wall example and give you two different examples to show you how this is done. This foil is pressed up against the siding. Now assuming this is a siding that's catching sun, it's getting hot, the hot side is, is the siding, this is the cool side. When the airspace, and we're inside the shed, so this is the cool side, when the airspace is on the cool side, it's working off of emissivity. So what this does is it releases or, or inhibits the ability for the siding to release the heat into the shed. Conversely, pretend the foil's not there and you put the foil stapling across the face of, of the studs here. Now you'd have an airspace. The siding would still get hot, but instead of being restricted, it's going to go across that airspace. It's going to hit this side of the foil and be reflected back. When the airspace is on the hot side of the foil, it's working off the reflectivity quality. And they're similar as far as the ability to impede heat flow, but really, if you can, you always want to get an airspace to the hot side and work off reflectivity instead of emissivity. The Department of Energy did a study where they compared the radiant barrier decking, which is a tech shield or solar board or some of these other uh, products that have the foil on the bottom of the roof deck, they work off of emissivity, which works fine. The Department of Energy studies uh, resulted that they reduced heat flow by about 30%. Total BTU reduction was about 30%. The radiant barrier stapled to the bottom of the rafters, attic foil type products, when you're stapled to the bottom of the rafters, reduced heat flow by about 50%. So it was almost double as effective at reducing the heat flow into the attic because you're working off the reflectivity and because you're covering the bottom of the rafters you're helping reduce some of the thermal bypass from the foil coming in. But that's the difference between reflectivity and emissivity. And if you want the information, uh, if you want to see the report from the Department of Energy, Oak Ridge National Laboratories comparing the radiant barrier decking versus the attic foil uh, sheet foil products, we have it on the website atticfoil.com. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe by clicking the button below, or if you want to see some related videos, click on the videos over here. For any other information, visit the websites atticfoil.com, warehousefoil.com, or roofingfoil.com. Thanks for watching.